Hello students, welcome to Swarov Sir's classes. In this video, we are going to solve few IIT Jam biotechnology uh, numericals which came in 2018 year. So let us begin with our first question. And as you can see, our first question is on limit, which is limit n tends to infinity. And here we have 3n square plus 5n plus 4 divided by 4 plus 2n square. So if we directly put infinity in place of n, then our limit will come in infinity by infinity form. So we do not want this form when this sum can be solved in a very easier manner. So what we will do here is we will divide numerator and denominator by n square. So here you can see we have limit n tends to infinity 3 plus 5 by n plus 4 by n square divided by 4 by n square plus 2. Now what we will do, now let us check by putting n is infinity. So here we can check we have 3 plus 5 by infinity plus 4 by infinity divided by 4 by infinity plus 2. So as you know anything by in, anything divided by infinity gives 0. So here we will have 3 plus since we have 5 here you can see we have 5 divided by infinity so this will give us 0 then we have 4 divided by infinity this will also give us 0 and in denominator we have 4 divided by infinity so this will give us 0 and then we have 2 so basically this is 3 by 2 which is 1.5 so here our answer will be 1.5 which you can see in option C so option C is our correct option now let us move on to our second question so you can see our second question is based on vectors so let us check here we have vectors a b and c so and we need to find the value of a plus b dot product c so we have been given three vectors a b c and we need to find a plus b uh, into dot product of c so first find first let us find a plus b so here we have vector a plus vector b so we can find we can see vector a and vector b so we will simply add these two so here is our vector a 10j plus 7k plus vector b which is minus 9i plus 6j minus 47k. So we will simply add each coefficients of i, j and k and we will find here 3 minus 9 is minus 6i. Then we have minus 10 plus 6 is minus 4j. Then we have minus 7 uh, plus 7 minus 47 is minus 40k. So this is a plus b vector. Now we need to find a plus b vector dot product of c vector. So this will be minus 6i minus 4j minus 40k dot product of c is 11i minus 17k and we have no coefficient of j so you know uh, by dot product here we have two rules since we have two rules i dot i when we have i dot i vector this will be equal to 1 again we have j dot j this will also be equal to 1 and we have k dot k this is also equal to 1 and second we have i dot j is equal to 0 or i dot k is also equal to 0 and we have j dot k is also equal to 0. So these two properties are valid for dot product. Now let us find here. First we will multiply this minus 6i with these two. So here we will find minus 6 into 11 is minus 66. Then we have i dot i is 1. So this it will be minus 66 and then we have minus 6 into minus 17 where we will get i into k which is 0 so we will neglect that term. Now our second is minus 4j into 11i and 17 minus 17k. So you can see here we do not have j term and the rest terms will come 0 so we will again neglect this term also. And then we have are left with minus 40k. So we will multiply minus 40k with 11i. So here we will get minus 440 uh, in i into k so as you can see i into i dot k is 0 so we'll neglect that term also and then we are left with minus 40 k dot minus 17 k so minus 40 dot minus 70 is 680 so here we will have minus minus plus 
680 and k dot k is equal to 1 as you can see here. So we are left with minus 66 plus 680 will give us 614. So our correct answer to this question is 614. Now let us check the options available. So here are our four options 614, 746, 2 and 134. So our correct option is 614 that is option number A. Now let us move on to our third question. So here is our third question which says the number of three letter words with or without meaning which can be formed using the letter of virus without repetition of letters is. So by this sum you can see that this is a permutation and combination sum. So here we have been said the number of three letter words. So we need to find three letter words with or without meaning. So it need not form any meaning but we just need to find three letter words from the word virus. So we will use the letters V, I, R, U and S and find three letter words with or without meaning without repetition. So here we, you can see that the number of letters in word virus is 5. V, I, R, U, S. Number of letters is 5. Number of letters in virus. You can see 1, 2, 3 and 5. This is 5. And the number of letters we need to select is 3. Number of letters to be selected is equal to 3. Uh, sorry, this is 3. Number of letters to be selected is 3. So, the number of ways, it, it is uh, asked the number of 3 letter words. So, the number of ways in which we can select this is number of ways. Since we need to find uh, the number of ways, we will use permutation here and out of 5, we need to select 3. Out of 5 letters, we need to select any 3. So, this can be done in 5 P 3 ways, which is 5 permutation 3, which is 5 factorial divided by 5 minus 3 factorial, which is 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 factorial divided by 5 minus 3 is 2 factorial. So, 2 factorial and 2 factorial get cancelled. We have 5 into 4 into 3, which gives us 60. So, there are 60 ways in which we can find 3 letter words from virus without repetition with or without meaning. So, our answer is 60. Now, let us check the options. So, you can see option C has 60. So, option C is our correct answer. Now, let us move on to our fourth question. So, here you can see our fourth question is based on integration. So, you can see we have integration x square into ln x dx. So, here we have two components. So, we will use integration by parts. And integration by parts has a general form which is known as i let. And here you can see we have algebra over here and L logarithm over here. So L comes before algebra. So we will take logarithm as our first term. And in by parts, we can write it as L, ln x dx. We can write ln we will take as first term. So ln x integration of second term that is integration of dx square minus integration differentiation of first term that is differentiation of ln x with respect to x and integration of second term which is integration of d x square dx and whole dx. So here we can write ln x integration of x square will give us x cube by 3. So this is x cube by 3 minus integration differentiation of ln x with respect to x will give us 1 by x and again x square integration we will get x cube by 3 dx. So, here we will have x cube ln x divided by 3 minus here 1 by 3 we can take constant outside and x cube by x will give us x square dx. Now, this will be x cube by 3 ln x minus 1 by 3. X, cube, x square integration will again be x cube by 3. So, this plus c do not forget to add plus c as a constant because in indefinite integration plus c is a mandatory thing. So, final answer will be x cube by 3 ln x minus x cube by 9 plus c. Now, let us check the options where x cube by 3 ln x minus x cube by 9 plus c. So, as you can see in option a, we have x cube by 3 ln x minus x cube by 9 plus c. So, option a is our correct answer to this question. So, we have solved few questions of IIT JAM biotechnology which appeared in 2018. So, I would like to end this video here.